beautiful people. Today we are going to talk about mittens. Mittens are these coverings that we put on the hands of our babies made of soft fabric and uh, they have this elastic at the wrist to prevent them from falling off. Mothers wear mittens for their babies because and when the babies are born, they tend to um, take a while to adjust to our environment. It's so nice and warm and cozy in the womb. And once they come out, um, they feel cold. So sometimes you see a newborn and their fingers are uh, purplish or bluish or darkish, depending on whether your baby is very fair or it's a dark baby. And um, so keeping the mittens on prevents the hands from getting cold. But sometimes actually this peplish discoloration is not only because the baby is cold, it's also because their circulatory system is not so well developed yet. And then mothers also wear mittens for their babies because um, the babies when they are born, they have these um, movements that are uncontrolled. They just tend to take their hands towards their face. And then when their nails are grown, they scratch their face. And you don't want your baby to hurt uh, himself or herself. So mothers keep the mittens on to prevent that. Some of the mothers also wear the mittens because when they see the baby sticking their hands to their mouth, they are afraid that this is going to be a habit. The baby is going to grow up and be a thumb sucker or a finger sucker, somebody who is always having the thumb in their mouth. So they keep the mittens on to prevent their babies from sucking their thumb. So those are the reasons why mothers wear mittens for their babies. But is it a good thing or it's a bad thing? A lot of experts say that by the time you get home, after you've had your baby, when you are discharged from hospital, you should remove the mitten for your baby. Or at most two weeks, you should remove the meeting for your baby. And this is why they say so. The first reason is that babies, when born, see, but they don't see very well. They don't know the environment. And they use their fingers to help them to make sense of everything. So when they touch you, when they touch your skin, their fingers help them to realize that this is money. Or their fingers help them to realize that this is not mommy. Probably this is the bed. But when babies wear mittens, that ability to tell this is mommy, this is not mommy, is a bit diminished because of the mitten. So the hand is not directly in contact with whatever it is they are touching. So that is diminished. So you should remove the mitten because it helps the babies to develop um, their sensory system. It helps their sensory development for them to quickly tell who is what and learn it in the few days after they are born. The other reason is that mittens hinder the motor skills of the baby. When we say motor, we mean movement. Babies are moving their hands, but when you wear mittens for them, sometimes their hands become a bit bulky and it impedes this movement. And then they need to use, move their fingers as well. And mittens prevent this from happening. So mittens will also slow their motor development. And then the other thing, babies put their hands in their mouth a lot of times, mostly because it soothes them. This is something they were doing in the womb before they were born. So it is not something they are now learning. It soothes them, it calms them down. And so when you wear mittens for them and they are not able to do this, they are not able to calm themselves down, it leads to a lot of frustration and they will cry more. Even if your baby is not a crying baby, it helps for you to remove the mitten because maybe the baby is not crying but is still frustrated. Let them put their hands in their mouth. Well, not let them, just if they want to put their hands in their mouth. They should put their hands in their mouth because it suits them and it calms them. They were doing this in the womb before they were born, so it's not now that they are going to learn it. When you prevent babies from soothing themselves, like I said, they get easily frustrated and they cry more and you don't want your baby to do that. You want your baby to use their energy to grow and to learn what is around them and not to cry. So these are the reasons why experts say do not wear mittens for your babies. So what can you do? Just trim your baby's nails. They grow very fast, also trim them fast so that they don't hurt themselves. But if unfortunately they hurt themselves, they scratch their face and leave those marks there. Those marks heal in about a day or two. They are not deep and they don't leave scars on their faces. I know it's not nice to watch and we all love our babies. We want to protect them and everything, but don't feel bad if once in a while your baby scratches their face because it's not going to leave any scars. The marks don't last long like that. They just disappear. So there you have it. You can wear mittens in the first few days, but after that, 
free the hands of the babies so that they can learn their environment, so that they can soothe themselves. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope that you have subscribed. If you haven't, please subscribe. And if you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you have any questions, put them in the comment section. I'm very, very happy to hear from you. Thank you. Bye.